What is up, my Pick and Bricks family? It is Pick and Bricks coming to you from Pick and Bricks headquarters, the Lego Asylum, with another episode of What's in the Pick and Tote. So, this is going to be my fourth episode of What's in the Tote. This one's crazy. This one's huge. This one, I believe, is a reorganization tote from when I was starting to reorganize the Lego Asylum. Because there seems like there's some brick in here. As I move it around, there seems like there's some crazy stuff in here. So, we're going to pop it. Oh, yeah, there's a there's a lot of crazy in here. This one is crazy, okay? Yeah, there's definitely some crazy in here, so let me pop this open. Let's give it a whirl. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Wow, yeah, there's a lot going on in here. This is probably the craziest bin that I think I've opened to date. Um, there is a lot going on in here, uh, starting with this uh, Ultra Agent set here, Toxikita. I believe this was the set Toxikita showdown something's got the crazy like toxic balls in the back that fall out the ship here this little helicopter so we're just going to put that up there I believe I see the uh, hidden side bus in here as well so I'm going to pull that out too we do have the hidden side bus which I 100% completely forgot I own this set so that's a good pickup right there so I'm going to put that right down over here next to me uh, there is a lot of random stuff in here. There's a receipt from Target for some Lego. So we'll throw that away. It's an old receipt. I don't even know where to begin. There's so much stuff in here. It looks like a lot of the bottom could be poly bags. So we might have some poly bag stuff in here too. Um, this is interesting. It's, uh, you know, some uh, tools there still on the sprue. So that's kind of interesting. So we'll throw that right there. Uh, let's just dig in. You got some battle packs, some Imperial transport or Imperial troop transport battle packs from Rebels. We got some Shadow Troopers here. Sealed battle packs are always a good play. We got a B. We got the the Valentine's Day B. I guess you want to call this Brickhead. No idea why, when, or where I got this from. I was not a huge Brickhead fan, but obviously I got this from somewhere. I have no idea where though. So uh, it's kind of funny. Uh, you're the pig. We got You're the Pig, little, little You're the Pig set. I have no idea when or why I got this either. So, kind of fun. Uh, game, video game. Okay, that's cool. Uh, PS3, Jurassic World, that is not in there. But if you guys want to use that code, go unlock Dr. Wu for you. There you go. Let me put it up there so you guys can see that code there. There you go. I know this is like Pokemon cards back in the day. But PS3 game, if anybody still wants to use the code, have at it. Go use the code. Uh, this is an old space police set which it was sealed at one point it is not sealed anymore i don't know why it's not sealed but it looks like some of the stuff is still in here so maybe i had it i needed a piece for it and then i probably opened it up and uh you know took out the piece so that's old space police right there wow there's some stuff in here there we got some 3d printed figs uh we actually got these from i think i don't even know me and cheap ass bought these um from a guy and actually he this one says my name on it um, this is when 3D printing like first started and people were just starting to try to 3D print the figs. So um, these are two like, almost like prototypes, if you will. So we're going to put those on the table over here. We got so much to get through in this tote. There is so much in here. Philly Brick Fest 2016 Brick Olympics. We were we, we placed we're gold medalists there. So that I can find. I hadn't no I didn't realize where that was. So that's actually pretty cool. Uh, hidden side. This was a G Dub. I think these are both the GWPs. Why is that popped? That's not good. I don't think it's open, but these are both the GWPs. Yes, these are those, uh, what were these? The uh, juicery bar, Newberry juicery bar. Hidden side, we got two of these. One's pops, but it's still sealed. Just that must have opened up there. And then, so we got both of those. So could cool there. I know those were GWPs. Um, this here, old uh, Batman and Super Angry Kitty Attack, Lego Movie 1. One of my favorite themes. I love the Lego Movie 1. Those these sets were just fire. Um, this honestly might be off the top here. This might be all poly bags. So this might be a huge tote of poly bags. And if it is, I will let you guys know. Uh, this is Bad Zaro, um, Justice League here with the DVD. And then the minifig in there is still sealed. I got a bunch of these still in the in the collection that are still sealed. Um, another uh, bean be, be there, donut that. Another one of these. I think I... Uh, popped open one of these in a future or previous bin in a past bin i think i actually opened up one of those as well um we got little uh 
little battle pack here, if you will, a little Batman battle pack. This is the one that makes the uh, the bat light, so the bat signal. So that's kind of why I wanted this one. So I think I have a couple of these, so I'm, they're probably not worth anything. But yeah, I'll throw them out there anyway. So that's cool. We got some Ninjago uh, Toys R Us exclusive. Uh, I remember when they put these on the, the peg hooks here. So we got a couple of these Toys R Us exclusive, only at Toys R Us. Still got those plastic hooks for the top here. So that's actually pretty cool. Um, I literally think that this whole box is going to be poly bags after these. But uh, we got some Imperial Trooper battle packs, some old battle packs. These are definitely older battle packs. So those are definitely cool with the little walkers here. These are from, uh, uh, let's see, 2017. So 2017 battle packs. Uh, with the Imperial Death Troopers in here too. So there's two Imperial Death Troopers in there too. So these might have some some value. I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to look those up too as well. Um, we do have some poly bags in here. Um, but again, this is a lot of see we got a see we got a CMF in here. Just a just a sealed CMF. It might be the chaser fig. I don't even know. Could be the chaser fig. We got Hoth. We got Han Solo, Hoth Han in the poly bag. We got Western Emmett hanging out there from the Lego movie one. Um, there is a bunch of amazing stuff in here. So we got Mo, we got this dude here. We got that dude still in the package. I don't know where I got him from. from Maui. We got Maui here hanging out. Big poly bags here. These big old poly bags from like a camp poly bag with the, uh, with the tents in them. Those are pretty epic there. Um, I'm gonna put some of this down because I think the honestly the bulk of this rest of this is all poly bags. Yeah, this whole tote is poly bags all through here. This is all poly bags. But another brickhead. Where did I get a turkey brickhead from? I don't know why I'm, I'm got turkey brickheads, but I do have a turkey brickhead. There is some more sets in here which I will go through to show you guys because I do see something that's completely 100% fire and epic. Not this set. This has meant to be just like a throw-in. This is just in there sealed. Just a throw-in. I don't even know when this was from. 2013. This is old school. 2013. Man, this is older than almost my my YouTube career. Um, another Western Emmett? Is that another one? Or is that the one I threw back? That might have been the one I threw back. Oh, no. Maybe this is another one. Is this another Oh, this is another one. Another Western Emmett. Okay, I got this guy, too. This guy's chillaxing, the old Kessel Mine Worker, chilling in there. Um, another Shazam. I think this Shazam was the one I pulled the poly bag out of. So this is probably just the, the DVD. Yeah, this is yeah, the poly bag. I pulled the poly bag out of this one. So this is just the DVD out of that one. But I do have another one that looks like over there sealed. Yep, another Shazam poly bag with the poly bag intact. I do have another Imperial Troop Transport. So there's another Rebels Battle Pack sealed um this i'm waiting to get to because this is absolutely epic so you'll see this in a second another true imperial troop transport sealed i don't think there's anything in here there's a little box with nothing in there so there's nothing in that box um but the epicness is going to start right now so i'm going to show you guys a little bit of fire right here not this this is not fire but it's pretty cool i love this one benny space squad you get all four of the space figures in there great deal too and you get the little buildable robot too which is an awesome i think it's an awesome awesome deal this is the hobbit we got a hobbit dvd in here got a little hobbit dvd with bard the bowman exclusive bane so that poly bags in there so remember when they were doing dvds for the hobbit with the poly bags in there so those guys are in there chilling too so that's that's cool poly bags still sealed in there um got some dimensions we got some more dimensions here so we got two dimensions adventure time here. We got some vampire action. I don't know how much those are worth. Probably not much, but we got two of those there. So that's chilling right there. So that's pretty cool. And then the the coup de gras of this tote, I want to show you guys right now, is this right here. And if anybody doesn't know what this is, this is, yes, a Marvel Super Heroes Lego game from 2013. But if you get really, really close on this, and, you, and if, if the camera wants to, it's not going to want to focus in there for everybody to see. But yes, there is still a, a sealed Iron Patriot poly bag in this, in this box. This has never been opened, and this is from 2013. So there's a sealed Iron Patriot minifigure 
poly bag in this box still from a PlayStation 3 game. Yes, I remember when I got these. Actually, there was a couple of these. I think I actually gave one away as a giveaway, but I found it. One of the Walmarts had them still on the shelf at like 10 bucks or something. So I had to grab all of them. But this is still one of the best, one of the best kind of coolest things in my collection right now. So Iron Patriot minifigure still sealed in the poly bag in this game right there. Honestly, the rest of this stuff is going to be, I got an instruction book, but I think the rest of this is honestly, this is all poly bags. 100% all poly bags here. And if you, if you thought you had a lot of poly bags, let's, uh, let's, let's battle, let's poly bag battle because I have poly bags for years and years and years. And this whole tote is actually just filled with poly bags and oh boy. Oh boy. And when you thought that there was nothing in here but poly bags, you pull out some gems like this. You pull out a gem like the Raptor Escape. 100% sealed. We bought we bought these by the grosses back in the day. But this is still 100% sealed. This thing was money back in the day. I don't know what it's going for nowadays, but I know this one was, I think this was a Walmart exclusive, I want to say. Um, so, pretty fire right there. And honestly, there is some um, sets at the bottom of this tote. So, it looks like I might have covered half the tote with poly bags and then half the tote with uh, sets. Because if you can see down here, there's a Lego train. There is some Lego semis down here. And then the rest of this tote is just straight fire with poly bags. So, um, again, just a crazy, crazy epic tote. Um, circa, I don't know when. I don't even know when I put this stuff away. But a little bit of everything in this tote. That, my friends, is the tote untoting, unearthing, unboxing for today. Like, comment, subscribe. And remember, life is better with free Lego from Thick and Bricks, the Mr. Beast of the Lego community.